assalamu alaikum hello everyone today we are starting going to start with chapter number 7 the name of the chapter is formatting text in word 2013 we have already done some work with word 2013 in chapter number 6 now we are going to one step forward with the formatting text in the word 2013 many terms from this chapter i have already explained uh, to you in uh, when we were talking uh, we were taking uh, chapter number 6 first of all formatting what does formatting mean anyone can tell me formatting when i talk about format it means changing something editing something what is that something we are going to edit or change when we are talking about word 2013 then we should make sure that it is about, we are talking about the text so formatting is a process of changing the general arrangement means some alignment of the paragraph and the text and some appearance of the text means how our text we are writing in the word document will be going to look like for example if, if we are going we want we have written something in the word document and we want to improve the looks and the appearance of text by changing its fonts its font color if we will change the font color it will be more attractive attractive and we can change the font size to make it bigger or smaller and the style we can change so these all things which we are changing these all the features we are changing in uh, uh, in the word uh, word document using word 2013 uh these all the changes we are making with the text are known as formatting so whenever we are going to change font color font size font style what we are doing we are going to do the formatting so formatting is the process of changing the general arrangement and appearance of the text improving the appearance of the text by using various font font color font size and font styles the next is how many times i said the font word so we should know what is a font font is a set of letters what we are writing in the word document is a text and text is a combination of letters so it is a set of letters it is a combination of letters and uh, not only the letters it can be numbers also it can be symbols also like punctuation marks so it will be a set of letters numbers or symbols of specific size it can be a size of 12 11 13 we can change also we can also change the sizes and the design like it can be calibre it can be area it can be italic it can be bold it can be underlined so these are the design which can be shown in the computer or we can also print this so font will be a set of letters of specific size and design it can be a set of numbers of specific design and size it can be a set of symbols also and it can be a combination of letter numbers and symbols also it's not particular that uh, particularly it cannot be like uh, that uh, it should be letters only it can be numbers only it can be symbols only it can be a combination of these three things a uh, separately a, a set of letters also is considered as font and a numbers also can be considered as a font and the symbols can also be considered as a font so when we are talking about a set and their spe of specific size design which can be shown in a computer or it can be printed also so we call that set is a as a font now clear what is a font so that set of letter and numbers we can change its font color its font size so means that set can be changed with the size with the colors 
with the stars also there is a term in this chapter used that default setting when we are going to install some software in our computer like i am going to install ms office microsoft office which includes uh, this uh, 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 word 2013 also when i will be installing this software in my laptop or in my computer uh, it will be opened it will be installed and when I will going I am going to open a new document it will be giving me some default settings like I will show you how for example I have installed this now and I have opened this new document blank document see what this page is having settings are all default like in the home tab it is it is always home tab which is open initially when I have created a new document it's Calibri font is Calibri and its size is 11 so by default from the manufacturer who have made this software he has put that these settings like whenever whoever is using this software and he is going to open a new blank page whenever he will be opening that blank page the fonts will be Calibri initially and the size will be 11 then so these settings are coming from the developer who developed this software who made this program who made this software of Word 2013 so these settings are set by him so these settings I will call them as predefined setting means he defined these settings already these are predefined settings so these predefined settings are known as default settings these will be default settings and now and I don't like Calibri I want my text to be Arial and I this 11 is very small I want it to be 14 now I will write class 3 so I want these settings so I changed this font I changed this size and also I want this bold I changed the setting of my page my text in this word document so when I am changing these settings these will be customized I changed I customized some setting of the word 2013 so this is these the settings we make with the software are customized setting and the settings which are coming from the uh, software developer or the programmer who made this software are known as default setting these are predefined settings of the software so okay coming to our point again we were talking about the default settings so default settings for example uh, default setting for a software which are given by a software developer or the person who made this software are known as default setting we call this predefined setting as default for example when we open new word document font is set to Calibri and font size is 11 I have shown this to you already so next page is telling us that what is a character formatting before we will talk about the character formatting let me tell you what is a character character in computer we call the alphabet or number or the symbol in the text as a character like um, class 3 I have written class 3 like this okay take an example from this I wrote it in computer so this C is a character O is one character in this word in this text computer each letter I will 
call it a 